Understanding Sink Like a Brick, a dive into English idioms. Hello and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore an interesting English phrase, sink like a brick. This idiom is a vivid expression used to describe something failing very quickly and completely. Let's break down what it means, where it comes from, and how you can use it in everyday English. The phrase, sink like a brick, is used to describe a situation where something fails very badly or becomes unsuccessful very quickly. Just like a brick would sink immediately if you threw it into water, this idiom paints a picture of rapid and complete failure. It's often used to describe projects, ideas, or even performances that do not succeed. Understanding the origins of idioms can often help us remember and use them correctly. The phrase, sink like a brick, comes from the simple physical reality that bricks, being dense and heavy, sink quickly when dropped in water. This imagery has been used metaphorically to describe failures or unsuccessful endeavors with a similar lack of buoyancy or hope. To get a better grasp of how to use sink like a brick in conversation, let's look at some examples. The new policy sank like a brick with the public, leading to its quick withdrawal. His joke sank like a brick at the meeting, making an awkward silence. I tried to introduce a new idea at work, but it sank like a brick. These examples show how the phrase can be used in various contexts to describe things that fail to gain acceptance, popularity, or success. Sink like a brick is a colloquial expression best used in informal contexts. It's perfect for casual conversations, creative writing, or when describing situations with a touch of humor or emphasis on the speed and totality of a failure. However, it's probably best to avoid it in very formal or serious communications. We hope this exploration of the phrase, sink like a brick, has been enlightening and will help you understand and use this idiom more effectively in your English conversations. Remember, idioms are a fun and colorful way to express yourself, and understanding them is a big step towards fluency. Thanks for watching. And we look forward to seeing you in our next video.